Hello everybody, it's the drummer12382 here and welcome back to the channel. Thank you guys so much for the love and support you guys have been showing on the recent content I'm releasing. I truly greatly appreciate it. Welcome back to another episode of The Walking Dead. Let's go ahead and just sign in. Like I said on my community tab, uh, I was out buying a suit uh, today because I have a wedding in a couple weeks that I'm, I'm going to. And this suit was urgent, so I had to get it tailored and yada yada yada. So, um, man, that was a hell of a yeah, ride, now huh? we're here. Jesus, Danny, what you ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, mama. Killed an innocent woman. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Missing every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They're always like that. It's how they are. I don't mind. That's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. Okay. I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. Okay, we're gonna talk to Kenny. Again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. Cool. I was thinking going back to the double upload schedule. Um I don't know yet. Let me know in the comments below if you guys want me to go back to the two uploads a day. I'll try and make it happen. Um, on certain days, it's just not possible. Like on Wednesdays, I'm not going to be able to do double uploads just because, uh, I'm in a rock and roll band and we rehearse. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. Uh. You really like that you gun. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Um, the bullets. Uh, it's just a gun. It's just a gun. That's where you're wrong. This is Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving hound when you got a bone in your pocket. Uh, you just run this. This place is one run cow. This place with just one cow. Used to have more. They get hungry too, or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. Now uh, this place is isolated. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Danny is weird. I don't like him very much. I think he's a little bit of a creep. Um, where did Kenny go? Uh, should we talk to Lily? Okay. Oh, there's a toolbox. Use. Um, give me the pliers. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Yes, borrow. You know, nothing, uh, just in case. Let's go talk to, to Lily, I guess. Hey, Lily, what's up? The hay, I already looked at. What's up? Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Uh, Danny shot someone. We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow. So Danny killed her. Holy shit. 
Was she one of those bandits? No. I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something. But then he just went off. I don't like this, Lee. I still say we should go back to the motor inn where we at least know what to expect. Facts. What were you and Kenny arguing what about? You arguing about when I came back from the camp. He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here. We don't need to be overstaying. Of course she did. More than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Uh, we're gonna leave. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, and we don't need you poking your nose where it don't belong and getting Fuck you, Larry. Our asses. I don't care about your opinion. I don't care about Larry's opinion very much. Hey friends. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. She's not sick, she's pregnant. What's this thing? Salt lick. Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? <laughs> yes. Uh, can I open these? Okay, nothing in that one. I just don't want anything popping down on them, you know? You know, just gonna make sure. Here's another salt lick. Okay. And what's in this one? Storage. More of the boxes. Empty. Lee being nosy. It's okay. And this is locked. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. Yeah, job to Kenny. Paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? Uh, I'll protect her. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya. What's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something, and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case then farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Okay. Um... Hey. Know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're, you know, urban. Oh, you are not. <laughs> think you're safe. <laughs> Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Hmm. I'm from Florida. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. And okay. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Danny's the weirdo. Always find something. Nope. Uh. Just checking out the just barn. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. 
Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, Mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Okay, I won't fuck around with the door then. Let's uh, hey guys, seriously, don't distract fuck Andy. With okay. Well, enough already. All right, we'll distract Andy. Let's just keep looking through the the doors then, I guess. Oh, stuff. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Yeah. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Sorry, I had to pause it. All right, let's continue. Okay, it's in this one. Hmm. Oh, I can actually click them. It's a feeding trough. Yes, it is a feeding trough. And then this might be the last one. Some fence posts. Yes. All right, let's go. Okay. Nothing that way. Uh, hey, Clementine. Here. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! Yes, I did. I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen. Did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Um... I haven't thought about it in a I while. Know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Let's see how she's doing. How do you like that cow, Clem? She's pretty. Okay, what's up, Doc? Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm, it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. <laughs> Kids. That's funny. Let them be kids, Katya. Shut up. Don't be a Karen. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Uh. Danny mentioned he needed something. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. All right, let's go. Uh, mess with the door. All right, let's do it. I found a multi-tool. Picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Okay, let's do it. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Damn it. Um, what can I do then? Uh, Katcha. How do you like that cow, Clint? Oh. She's pretty. I don't want to talk to Clementine. I wanted to talk to Katya. Oh, I can't. All right. Uh, let's talk to Danny, I guess, again. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Uh. Why do you lock that door? Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while, raid our stuff, even with the fence. Hmm. All right, let's just leave. Alrighty then. Mm. What can I do here? <laughs> Larry oh, flirting it up. A woman like yourself run this whole place. Oh, I managed just fine. Plus, I had my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without. Them. Hmm. 
Can I take this? Okay. What to distract with? How can I distract Danny? I don't know. Um, let's look at the gazebo. Okay, she's going to bring us up here. Um, does Lily have any any informative What's going information? On, Lily? Did something happen? Uh, there's something odd with the barn. There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. About your dad. Three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Uh, this. How do you put up with him? Does he treat you Does like that? You like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that, but he's not a bad guy. He just—he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much and lost pretty much everything. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. I'm starting to think that they may be behind some. I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Okay. Um. I don't know what to do. I'm kind of at a loss. Maybe if we fuck around with the generator. Turn switch. Turn it off, maybe? Okay. He didn't say anything. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Okay. That was close. Um let's look at the fence. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Okay. I'm just gonna say the same thing. Um. What's this? Picket fence. Okay. Yeah, Lee, that's what a fence is. It's pointy. Ah. Okay. It's moving fast. Okay, let's turn it off. Power switch. Turn off. And then. There, take the belt. Fucking Danny. Where do you find this piece of shit? Oh, Amazon. Through a belt. Damn it. Okay, let's go into the barn now. 
and see what we can't find. Not sus at all. Why does it look like it's nighttime now? All right, Kenny, I got this brother. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad, Dad, come on, let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on, don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Okay. Why do you leave it to me? It's his idea. Man. Okay. Do it one at a time. Screws holding it to the Yes. Lock. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Yes, I already I, that was an accident. All right, the lock is now off. Wow. They put the bear traps. Didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. Uh, why is there so much blood? Why was there so much blood in there? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Oh, <laughs> Brett. Biscuits? Wow! Excuse oh, a mess. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and I ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. Mind if I wash my hands and go upstairs and snoop? I'm gonna go snoop. Don't mind me. I'm just gonna go up, go upstairs. Check on Mark. <laughs> Look at how worried I'm like. Oh, don't be a ghost upstairs. I don't want there to be a ghost. I believe in the paranormal. There's a lot more in the zombie apocalypse. This house is haunted. Get the EMF meter out. Get the ramp pod. Get the obelisk. Okay. Anything I can like take? Do they need so much morphine for? Get people high. Ugh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers eat with this kind of stuff? I don't know. To do surgery on like an animal? Animals need morphine too to get high. There's blood. blood. Okay, the bookshelf. The bookshelf. Oh, books, cookbooks. Nothing out of the ordinary here. It's a weird painting. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. I don't know. I can't enter this door? Can't go any further than this? Small house. Okay. What the hell? 
Okay. Oh, I see. What am I supposed to do? Um. Farm books, cookbooks. Nothing out of the ordinary here. Yeah. And the blood. And then do I follow the cable? Some first aid recently. Nothing I can't. Oh, here we go. What the hell? Get Eily. Okay, now that that's there. There we go. Alright, let's push the bookshelf. Oh shit! Open it, Lee. It's Mark! Oh my god, they took both of his legs. Holy shit. Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? Don't eat dinner. Clementine. Go, 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 go. It's people. People. What? Huh? Yes, Lee. It's all people in here. Sit down. Your supper's getting cold. Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Yes. Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He Mark. He could use some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. The hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Mark's upstairs. Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Uh, they're picking us off to trade for me. They're picking us off to trade as me. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs! Brenda, tell me he's not being eaten right now. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in That's rural fucked. Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boss. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? Why is that blurred? What was that? They eat some more. We think we can put that meat to uh, bed. Oh, I'm going to puke. We outnumber him. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were going to die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get Kenny, out of here. Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the what? The fucking what? Put your what? guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my Mommy, fucking family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Somebody do something! <gasps> Lee? Please. Drop your! F I'll kill you. I'll kill you. Please. Someone. Ah. 
That's fucked. That's fucked. Achievement. Guess who's coming to dinner? Yo, sad fucking bastards! Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the goddamn door down! It, it was a person. I ate meat from a person. Does that mean I'm gonna turn into. No, no Clem. It, it... It doesn't work like that. If he would have stopped us in time. Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Uh, are you okay? Clementine, they, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here. This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here. Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. How can you tell her that? Okay, let's talk to talk to Lily. Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! Come on, try us out. Okay, air conditioning unit. Hmm. Did they take the multi-tool from me? Dad, you can't get. Uh, uh, Easy. Dad? That's fucked. No. Dad, come on. Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead. What has to happen, Lee? Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, 300 pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Good morning later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! Uh. Lily can save him. Can still save him. I wish she could. Believe me, I do. But that man is dead. You both know what happens next. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Got to destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. Uh, you gotta have my back this time. Uh, okay. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Uh. Oh. Uh, Q. No, no, no. Q, Q, Q. I thought this was going to automate itself. Ah, oh, fuck. Q again. What if I don't do Q? No. Hi, Lee. Lily said he wasn't dead. Oh, uh, man. Yeah. I'm sorry. We couldn't take that chance. You understand why we had to do this, Clementine. So we won't turn into one of those monsters? That's right. <laughs> I'm sorry, Clementine. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong. Too much salt will I kill you. you. Be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? Uh, you're a walkie-talkie. Walkie Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. 
Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. Okay, Jesus Christ. Let's talk to Kenny. You, uh, you think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. Um... It's just you and me? It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, she'd probably side with the St. John's against us. Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. Um... I know you hate Kenny. I know Kenny. you hate Kenny, and me too. But he did what he had to, so we can all go on living. For what? He's got his family, and you've got Clementine. I've got nothing. You've left me with nothing. Let's look at the body. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away. Okay. Air conditioning. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. Okay. Multi tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Well, yeah. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm -mm. Hmm. Not coming off that way. Okay. Let's try and maybe move some boxes. I don't know, man. Air ain't giving us us much choice. I know it was necessary, but I just wish Cliff didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. Hmm. What's up, boy? Um. The air conditioner might the be our way out. The air conditioner is big enough. We might have found our way out of here. Yeah? But I need something to loosen the screws. I got nothing. Shit. Hang tight. Maybe I can scrounge something. Man, that's what I tried, bro. Talk to Lily. Why can't you just leave me alone? Um, I need a coin. I'm sorry, Lily. You got like a penny? Out of here. We need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here, but I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. Like a penny? If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Thank you, Carl. Uh, Carly. Lily. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to switch up names. It's a dire situation. Uh, any idea which pocket he keeps his change in? You fucking vulture. Dude, that's... Imagine being passed out and, like, you have no idea what's happening and a brick just hits your head. My mother's. Don't worry. Not taking it. Hmm. Okay. Here. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. I think this game's in window mode. Hold on, let me change it to full screen. <laughs> Alright, it is on full screen. Okay. 
because I can when it's when I'm dur during a cutscene I can the taskbar is there sometimes you got it yeah one more should do it there we go Uh, we don't know where it leads. We don't know where it leads. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. I can find out. You're brave, Clementine. Uh, you don't have to you do don't this. Have to do this, right? I know. I just want to go home. This will help us get back home. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Sick. Air conditioning's loud. Okay. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. You're a good kid, Clem. Jesus. Yeah. Give me that sickle. If there was a hammer, we'd be communists. Okay. What's this? Oh, a hand hook. Cool. Oh, no. I want the sickle. I want the sickle. Be like children of the corn. Saw. God, what's wrong with these people? They're walkers, but living. Maybe I shouldn't have sent Clementine through there. This room would give anybody nightmares. All right, what's this? Oh, a walkie-talkie or a, ta a taser? Yeah, I'll take the taser. No, I want the no the sickle. Stop trading weapons. I want. Wait, what's in this? Jesus, is this where the butcher people? Okay. Yes, we know. Sick bastards, all of them. I want the sickle. All I've been doing has been trading weapons. Oh, okay. I thought I clicked the sickle. Okay, same thing. Hey, watch your step. That's slippery. Yeah. All right. No, I already watched this. Hey, watch your step. That's slippery. Give me. Okay. Let's go. Let's do this. 
So what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yes. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Stay close. All right. You're supposed to be going in front of me, Ken. Hey, what are you doing outside the barn? Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that. What's he doing out there? I don't know. Uh. I'll keep an eye on him. Be ready. He's setting the bear traps. Bro. <laughs> In front of us. What's he doing now? He's gone. Alright. I don't see him anymore. Where the fuck did he go? I don't know. Look again. He didn't go past us. See where he is now. I'm gonna be scared. Right there, I knew it. Grab it. Signal. Uh oh. Yeah, Kenny. Fuck you, bitch. Where's my family, asshole? You can't have them. We need the van. No, can't. Lee, come on. Just go. I won't be far behind. You understand now, don't you? You can have me. It's how the world works now. Get part of yourself so others can live. Hmm. Mark never volunteered to be food. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like he didn't kill Jolene. Mm. You don't have what it takes. <laughs> Fucking coward. It's not letting me kill him. It says choose Danny's fate. But then it's like... Can I not... Actually kill him? I guess I can't. This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. Fuck you, Lee. <laughs> she has a gun. Dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive. Fucking asshole. Oh man. Come in town and remember you spared it. There's the gun. Oh god, don't hurt him! That's Katra. Please, no! Lily, please. Keep her safe. All right, let's go save Katja. Kitty. Dude, I love the rain. There's just something about rain. Taking Charlotte. Carly! Yeah! Carly! Me? Ow! Shh! They fucked. We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. They attacked us. I knew it. I told you. Don't 
told you we couldn't trust them? Shit. How many of them are there? Two left. Where? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Yeah. <laughs> Good girl. Lee, be careful. No, no, please, no, no, no. Move. Yes, you do. Andy? Danny, is that you? What's going on out there? Uh. I left Danny in the bar. He got what he deserved. Oh. <laughs> nice. Yes. Why can't I move? There we go. Please, please don't you take another step. Brit, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. No, Brenda. You know I can't do that. Oh man. Uh. All right, click to continue. No, I can't do that. Uh, what am I supposed to do? I can't move forward. Okay. Stop right there. Okay. It doesn't have to end like this. What you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Oh, there's Mark. There's Mark. Stay back. Don't do anything stupid. Okay. Uh, let her go, Brenda. Go, Brenda. Please, listen to him. I'll do it. Please. No, you won't. All right, sorry. I had to pause it one last time. Let's continue. Escape. Uh oh. Please. Please don't make this any worse. Just stop. Oh my god, Kenny. Andy. Who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done. Um, calm down. Calm down? What for, huh? All we wanted was some goddamn gasoline. Nice, Carly. Cute. Oh man. 
Uh-oh. Shit, what am I trying to grab for? Come on. Oh my god, it's actually getting difficult. Oh my god, no 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 The keyboard destroyer of the game. I'm pressing Q. Wait. Am I supposed to press Q? What's what's gonna happen? Okay. Oh, now I press Q. Uh, right, left, right, left, right, right. What's with these cameras? Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit. It's over. Fuck you. This dude is dead and mama get out here. You, you all fucked. <laughs> They're not coming. They're not coming. What do you mean? Lee? What the fuck do you mean? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! You Lee. spared Andy's life. There's, there's mama. Damn. Dude, Kenny's just bleeding. Twenty-five. You fight like a dairy farmer. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Uh, yeah, they were. Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just, ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah, 
I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. Just, I'm Just bad. As young as I used to be. Hon, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? Uh, I'm with you. I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. Kenny Damn noticed right. your loyalty. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready. I've changed my mind. I want you to come with us when we leave. Yeah? Hell yeah. We're a team, man, me and you. By taking out Larry before he turned, you saved all of us in that meat locker. And that saved my family, too. Yeah, I'd say you earned it. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? Uh, we didn't kill them. We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from the walkers, but I'm sure they won't be coming after us. That's good. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? It's called thunder. Sounds like a car. Oh, God, not more strangers. You're a stranger. You're not a part of this group. <laughs> Fuck you, Ben. Uh, don't shoot. We're here don't to help. Shoot. We're here to help. Okay. Approach the car slowly. Okay, I'll do just that. I'm approaching slowly. All right. Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? We know no. Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? What if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? Uh, you're right. We shouldn't take this. Um, better for the group. Man, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of us. We have to take this, Clementine. There's seven of us. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Who says it's your decision to make? Hey, we don't have time for this shit. Like it or not, we need this food. Now get over here and open the trunk, Lee. Lily is out of her mind right now. Two, there was no window. Supplies. I'll take it. Supplies for you. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Supplies for you. Supplies for the man who got shot. More food in here. Carly. Okay. 
carry it. Don't drop that, Ben. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. We're not like the bandits. We're not like the bandits, honey. We didn't hurt anybody to get this. Understand? I guess so. You convince Clementine that it's okay to take the hoodie. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? <laughs> Lee, you're gonna want to see this. Oh, shit. Oh, they were recording us. It's not stealing if you need it. Was that supposed to be Clementine's Clementine's mom? Or just some randy kooky lady? Next time on The Walking Dead. Making is done, pal. Ain't nothing left. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lee, I need you to back me up on this. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phase is It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all of this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? But we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! A long road ahead. Very excited to start that soon. All right. I chopped off David's leg. You and 43 people decided to chop off David's leg. You shot Jolene. So you and 60% of players had Danny Shooter. Um, helped kill Larry. You and 49% of players helped kill Larry. Killed by killed both of the St. John brothers. You and 61% of players didn't kill the brothers. Stole food from the car. Half of the people kill, stole the food. That's the end of chapter 2, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed this chapter. I sure did. Um, I had a great time playing this chapter. A lot of shit went down, boys. A lot of shit went down. Can I, like... Okay, uh, again, I can't skip this. I hate that I can't skip this. I hate that I can't skip the credits. But, um... Yeah, uh, I don't think there's anything special at the end of the cr these credits. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and call this video here. So, without any further ado... Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I actually do greatly appreciate it. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. If you guys enjoyed today's video, please leave a like. And as always, I'll see you guys here tomorrow. Bye, guys.